व्हाट्सअप एवरी वन दिस इज राकेश यू वंस अगेन वेलकम टू द सेशन ऑफ ओरेकल एस क्यू एल एंड इन दिस वीडियो वी आर गोइंग टू सी वॉट एग्जैक्टली द सब्सटीट्यूशन ऑपरेटर इज एंड हाउ यू कैन गिव वेल्यू टू अ क्वेरी एट रन टाइम सो दैट इज अ टॉपिक विच वी आर गोइंग टू सी इन दिस सेशन सो लेट्स बिगिन सो गाइज वट इज सब्सटीट्यूशन ऑपरेटर सब्सटीट्यूशन ऑपरेटर इज नथिंग बट इफ यू वॉन्ट टू गिव will you at run time to a query then you use the substitution operator so what exactly will you will do you will uh, give the m percent and then variable name then it will take uh, will you at run time whenever you run the query so that is nothing but your substitution operator or this is how you can give the value at run time and this is what i have to explain in the theory rest of the part we will see in the practical session so let's begin so guys now let's see the practical session of the substitution operator okay so let's begin with the very simple example over here so let me fire one query on the employee table so this is how you can fire the query on the employee table okay so let me show you over here star okay so this is a complete record of the king now if you want to give this information at run time then how you can give you can give like this this is the substitution operator and this is the variable okay so let me run over here over here i have given the variable name as a dd so now run time when i run it this query then at the time it is asking the value of the last name so last name i am entering over here king so what exactly it will give it will give me the record of the uh, that king okay so over here i again run king okay and then it will give the over here record so this is nothing but your substitution operator now this is nothing but your variable and this is your operator this is the m person it is called the m person now over here uh, if you do not want to give a turn time and if you want to define it as a variable in environment then this is how also you can define in the environment so what exactly i have done over here i have given Uh, uh, done over here my variable defined inside the environment so when i will put over here then it won't ask me of the value of the uh, this variable it has already in the environment so what exactly over here it will do it will give me the row okay so let me show you over here one more uh, thing so let me change over here value what is my last name correct so if i will give the value over here last name and if i will run over here then it will give the value of the coacher okay so you can see over here it is giving the value of the coacher so this is nothing but your substitution operator it's a very simple it takes the input at the run time okay so over here this is the substitution operator and this is the variable now over here why i am using over here quotes because it's a text okay where care two type so that is the reason i have to take over here okay now let me take over here uh, employee id okay so employee employee underscore id okay so if i will give the employee id over here 101 okay then also it, so let me run over here so it is giving over here now let me remove this okay then what happened let's see then also it is giving why because it is a number type over here it's a number type correct so that is the reason it is giving and that is the reason over here we do not need to give the single code even though if i will remove over here this one then also it's a fine okay so now over here since it's a number so i do not need to give the single code okay when i need to give the single code when i have the character kind of value or i can say that in case of the care where care to or where care this kind of data type if we have then in that case we have to give or maybe date data type so uh, at that time we have to give so this is nothing but your substitution operator and this is how we can use it okay guys and this is very oftenly we use in the live environment okay guys so that's all for the day and i hope you have understood so guys i hope you have understood what exactly the substitution operator is and if you have any feedback then please don't forget to let me know in the comment box thank you so much for watching for the video bye take care